Assalamualaikum and very good afternoon guys. Hello. Good afternoon doktor. Boleh boleh dengar suara saya? Boleh doktor. Boleh doktor. Boleh, eh? boleh boleh. Alright alright. Okay uh, so for today alright uh, I'm going to share with you Okay, before we begin, let us begin uh, our class with uh, Umur Kitab Al-Fatihah. Okay, let's begin. Okay, let's begin. Okay, let's begin. Ya, Aiman nak kata apa? Ada soalan ke? Aiman alias. Tak ada apa-apa eh? Alright, alright. Guys, uh, for today, alright, I'm going to share with you the uh, assessment that uh, we are going to provide to you and what are your assignment. So, I'm going to explain to you. Alright, I'm going to share the screen about the uh, screen. Window. Hello guys, boleh nampak tak saya punya screen ni? Boleh je. Nah, assessment briefing boleh, nampak kan? Boleh. Okay guys, uh, this is what you are supposed to do. I'm going to give you explanation on how are you going to go about, alright? Alright, ni adalah kita punya assessment methods and types, alright? Uh, so, as you know, we are doing 100% coursework. Okay, online quizzes, 20%, all right. We did uh, our topic one, topic two, all right. Now, we are going to do second quiz, okay. I already shared the second quiz with you, right. So, uh, it is the same. Uh, you have to summarize the, the video, all right. But this time, don't forget to write down your name and also your magic number. And then, uh, now, this is about online individual assignment, all right. Is a twenty percent, alright. So we will we will give two assignment, two individual, and also two online group assignment, alright. Excuse me, doctor. Yes. Uh, are you sharing the second or third slide already? This is the come again one, two. Ah, uh, second slide. Can you uh, see? We can, we can see the first one, sir, doctor. Now, 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 uh, are you copying the same uh, screen that I have, uh, MCO assessment method? Uh, no, Dr. We're looking at the assessment briefing, the first page. Oh, not the second page? Yeah. Oh, you don't get the second page, eh? Okay, hold on, hold on, eh? Okay, can you see the second page? Hello? No, 
doctor not yet not yet no doctor not yet, yet eh yeah not yet eh okay okay hold on hold on okay doctor now yes Ah, sekarang nampak tak? Sekarang ada doktor. Sekarang ada. Ya, yeah, eh? doktor. Ah, MCU, assessment methods. Okay, jelas eh? Okay, now uh, I told you, okay, uh, we are going to come up with two online quizzes. Ada dua quiz online, 20%. Yang mana kita dah buatkan topik 1, topik 2 and then uh, now topik 3, topik 4. Okay, so I dah share dah uh, quiznya. Nanti you boleh tengok dekat online uh, online learning. So it is basically the same concept with the previous one. I provided a, a video and you have to summarize it. Hello, yeah. Online. Uh, saya bagi sampai malam awak. Itu eh, soalan tu kita potre. Ah jawapan tu boleh jawab tengah malam nanti sampai sebelum 11.55. Boleh? Hello. Hello. Boleh eh? Ah okey. Okey right. So I dah bagi discount boleh jawab sampai tengah malam sekali. Okay, uh, online individual assignment. Uh, this is the one that we want you to do. Alright, uh, it's a 20%. Maknanya 10%, 10% lah untuk each tu. Kemudian online group assignment. Ada dua uh, group punya tugasan. Uh, 30%, 30%. Alright. Lepas tu, uh, dia punya uh, topic tu. Alright. Uh, apa ni? Uh, topic 6 and topic 8, topic 8, okay, uh, record and then uh, assignment nombor 2 tu apply lah, alright, uh, combination of a few topics, alright. <coughs> okay, ini in first individual assignment, okay, uh, instruction dia, uh, you have to write all in English, right, your assignment should be typed, the format given in the question, Do not copy the assignment question and instruction to your answer. Kita nak jawapan saja. I'm not, I'm not going, I'm not asking uh, of your uh, questions. I just need the answer. Alright, you must submit your assignment according to the task given. Your assignment must be submitted on 28th of, uh, of November. Alright. Uh, and then, uh, according to the question, okay, uh, do, you should not copy other per, another person's assignment. You should also not plagiarize another person's work as your own. Okay, this assignment 10% of the total marks. Okay, the purpose. This assignment is to ensure the students are capable to comply and meet CLO number two. Course learning outcome number two. You know how to explain the history, the concept and the theory in warehouse management. Uh, very straightforward. Okay. So this is the, the, the how, how you should uh, explain lah. The, the warehouse activity profiling. Okay, task number one, based on figure 1.0 in slide number four, you are required to explain each of the warehouse activity profiling process with relevant information. Refer to the main e-textbook which I already provided or any relevant textbook. So, Doctor, we give you free slide Doctor tak bergerak. Slide tak bergerak. Nampak tak ni? Uh, nampak nombor dua. Slide yang kedua. Yang seterusnya tak gerak. Okay. Uh, ni tak gerak? Nampak tak, tak ni? Gerak. Tak gerak eh? Tak.
Okey nampak tak figure 1.0 ni? Ah uh, nampak doktor nampak. Nampak nampak. Ah figure ni nampak eh? Alright. So ni oh, soalan dia. Yang question 4 tak nampak. Eh question pula slide nombor 4. Sekarang slide nombor 2. 2 3 4. Ni 4 ni. Figure 1.0 ni slide slide nombor 4. Nampak tak? Sekarang show ni slide nombor tiga sir. Operational process ni nampak tak? Tak nampak sir. Okay nampak tak nampak tak apa. Sekarang ni saya cerita je. Nanti you boleh go through dekat ni. Sebab I already posted dalam online learning. Alright. So you just get the information that I provided now. Okay alright. So now alright apa yang kita nak. Okay task one based on figure 1.0. Alright. So you should uh, come up with uh, explain each of the warehouse activity. So tengok balik dekat figure 1.0 tu warehouse activity tu apa benda activity dia daripada receiving, put away, storage. Uh. So each processes ni kita explain. Alright. And then uh, you can refer to the main textbook or you may refer to any other textbook as a source of information. Okay, yang ini yang paling penting. Choose, pilih satu warehouse service provider. Alright, bila pilih satu warehouse service provider and then start with introduction of the company. Alright, so remember that I ask you to come up with uh, share with me any warehouse within your within the your housing area. Okay, alright. Uh, so write down the name of your company. So now, awak the uh, class captain. Who is the class captain? Ni Tia. Hello? Yes, doctor. Okay, Ni Tia. And then I want you to um, uh, you can also use the uh, WhatsApp to 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 assist you, alright? Uh, so each and every one of you need to fill in the uh, you come up with a Google form, alright? So uh, write down the name of the company. So I hope that there, there are no one going to come up with two same company. All right. Uh, if possible, try to do any different company lah. All right. Uh, so Nitya punya kerja, uh, Nitya tolong come up dengan uh, Google Form. All right. Google Form tu tulis nama, nama, nombor metric and then apa nama company tu. Uh, nama warehouse tu kemudian uh, lokasi warehouse alright Nitya ok eh hello uh -huh. alright so the following information needed for each of the process uh, ni cerita lah definition, importance, the step involved so uh, what kind of material handling equipment that you use and then picture of the process. You may add any relevant facts, figures or example of the process. Additional mark will be provided for additional information and creativity. So minimum is 5 pages and maximum 8 pages of the report. So you are advised to plan your report properly. All right. Produce a slide note using Microsoft PowerPoint based on your report. Maximum 10 slides. Alright, attach one link of the YouTube video about warehouse activity profiling and provide a summary of the video content. Okay, so three tasks ni lah. Okay, the next one. Okay, that one just now we talk about the first individual. Now the second individual assignment. Alright, again uh, the instruction answer all in English. Your assignment should be typed. The format given in the question. Do not copy the assignment question and instruction to your answer. I just need the answer. No questions on that one. So you must submit your assignment according to the task given. Okay, must be submitted on 12 December. Alright. Uh, ni biasa lah. You should not copy another person assignment. You should not, you should also not plagiarize another person work as your own. Okay, the next one. Okay, these are the instructions. You are required to find a warehouse company or a company which has its own warehouse and answer the following. Alright. So, 
Dalam kes ni, you boleh guna company yang uh, assignment number one tadi ataupun you nak guna company lain dalam ka, apa uh, assignment yang yang kedua ni lah. Alright. So, kita nak uh, what are the entrepreneurial activity that you observe from the company. Remember, I ask you to go to to visit the company or you visit the company through your uh, Google Map, whatever. But the most important, we want to do, we want to know. What are the entrepreneurial opportunity that you observe? Okay. The second thing, what are the inter- entrepreneurial experience that you find in the company? Number three, how does the company respond to risk tolerance in their daily operation? Or does the company have a clear direction on their internal locus of control? Or the, do the company set their target of achievement and perseverance? Ini kalau you boleh interview orang dia pun lagi cantik lah. So, orang dua and then uh, get this idea. Or you may also get the, the information from their website. Buatlah macam mana pun. Alright. And then, uh, how are we going to evaluate? This assessment, this assignment account for 10% with total marks for the, for the course and shall be assessed based on the rubrics. Uh, so, uh, we are going to uh, evaluate you according to the uh, entrepreneurial skills rubric. Okay. The purpose of this assignment, yeah, okay, we want to ensure you guys capable to comply and meet learning outcome uh, component. All right. So, the requirement complete all tasks, all right, you are supposed to write no more than 10 pages excluding the references of the report in Flipbook. Alright, uh, please register the name of the company in the Google form. Alright, so uh, you, uh, again, uh, uh, I'm not going to give you a lot of trouble. I hope that you just use uh, the same company lah kan. Uh, the assignment number one and also assignment number two. Alright, so that uh, I will get to know the name list of the company from from uh, Google form provided by Nitya Alternati lah. Okay. Alright, that is about uh, assignment, individual assignment number two. Okay, next. Okay, this is going to be group assignment. So, how many people in a group? I hope that not more than five. Alright. So, and then again, uh, Nitya punya assignment juga. Alright, Nitya tolong um, uh, buat satu Google form juga. Uh, semua orang uh, letakkan siapa uh, dama ketua kumpulan. Okay, dengan ahli kumpulan. Alright, uh, ni kerja dia. Alright, instruction to all students. Alright, uh, steam. The, the the question will be answer all in English. Your assignment should be typed the format given in the question. Do not copy to standard lah. Alright, sekarang kita nak cerita pasal macam mana kita nak evaluate. How would it be on the evaluation? This assignment accounts for 30% of the total marks for the course and shall be assessed based on the rubric prepared. Okay, the purpose of the assignment question, all right, this assignment is to ensure the students are capable to comply and meet CLO3, discuss the relationship between uh, macro and micro environment uh, within the warehouse management, all right. Requirement, complete all the tasks. All right. How are you going to go about? All right. So, this is the explanation. Assignment is going to be in the form of an article. Kindly follow the article template given. Should be prepared minimum 10 pages excluding references. So, there are 10 topics to be chosen by the group. All right. So, topic one, intro to warehouse management, two group. Kalau warehouse ni, two groups juga. Alright. So, jadi, bila ada dua group ni apa semua ni, sekarang ni, uh, Nitya kena prepare, alright, group berapa yang nak pergi dekat topic one. So, group berapa yang nak pergi dekat topic two. Alright. So, after this, alright, uh, communicate uh, uh, group leader, bagi tahu dekat Nitya, alright, uh, nak topic mana. Alright. So, by the end of the day, I hope I give you a, a, a chance lah for you to discuss after this, alright. So, maknanya kata sebelum kelas kita habis hari ni, sebelum 2.20, kita dah tahu dah uh, group siapa untuk topik satu, group siapa untuk topik dua, alright. 
that is the 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 the, uh, the way how to do it Okay, so sekarang kita bagi tahu kena buat dalam bentuk artikel. So, artikel ni ada macam-macam format. Format dia kita ada bagi dalam online learning. Macam mana format dia? Alright. Okay, ni lah format dia. Letakkan tajuk dia macam mana. Alright. Uh, dia punya content, mesti ada abstract, ada conclusion, ada ni. So, uh, so uh, you, uh, I give you you uh, an idea lah. Alright. So uh, on the topic ni apa sebenarnya introduction to warehouse management ni? So kena tengok what are the issues in warehouse management? So what are the issues and challenges in warehouse design? What are the challenges and issues in measuring benchmark? What are the issues and challenges on the warehouse equipment? So what are the issues and challenges on the warehouse layout? All right. How are you going to come up with the issues and challenges? Up to you. You want to go You want to come up with analysis uh, using uh, SWOT analysis, uh, strength, weakness, weaknesses, opportunity or threat, or you want to come up with um, apa, Ishikawa fishbone diagram on the issues and challenges. Yeah, up to you. Based on your own creativity on how you you elaborate the topic on issues and challenges on each uh, chapter lah. Okay, right. Next. Uh, So and then present it in terms uh, in 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 the uh, point form lah. All right. So you also refer uh, if you refer to article, write down the reference. If you refer to a book, write write down also the reference. So this is the format of the of the article and also how you should uh, summarize the topic. Okay. Next. Okay. This is the second group assignment. All right. Instruction to students, okay, answer all in English, ini standard. Your assignment should be type pun standard. Okay, ni apa semua? Okay, evaluation. This assignment account for 30%, okay, 20% of the report and 10% recorded presentation of the total marks for the course and shall be assessed based on the rubrics prepared. Okay, purpose of the assignment Okay, we want you to comply and meet CLO number three. Discuss the relationship between macro and micro environment within the warehouse management. Alright, so okay, uh, how it should be? Alright, so you need to choose one company. Alright, so um, uh, in a group, you choose one company. Alright, uh, get the overview of the company. Uh, you write down what are the background or the location what are their main services what are their who are their main customer okay uh, elaborate on their inbound activity how they do receiving uh, how they come up with their quality control okay how how do they do their put away and what kind of storage activities that they are dealing with And then uh, about the outbound, okay, how they do picking, sorting, packing, shipping. And then do they implement a reverse logistics? And then uh, uh, explain a bit on their safety and security aspect, all right? Uh, so if they uh, uh, apply the CCTV, uh, how, oh, how, how do they do that uh, implementation-wise, maintenance-wise? Elaborate on that one. And then what about their material handling equipment and other facilities? What are other facilities in their warehouse? And then how how they go about with the layout of the warehouse? And then uh, uh, maybe you can come up with the conclusion and what are your recommendation? And then so minimum 10 pages, maximum 12 pages of report in flip book. Okay, you are advised to plan your report properly. Provide table of content of the report insert pages and list of the x uh, list of the references and then maximum eh produce a 10 minutes recorded video presentation to describe and explain the topic all group members must participate in the video okay you can insert suitable sound or mp3 or audio or any audio effect or image or slide presentation in this recorded video presentation all right So that's all. Uh, any questions so far? Uh, doctor, for the individual assignment, okay, the 
the warehouse company we find uh is it can be a a not a local warehouse company or up to you up to you doesn't matter i don't have any um uh, restriction on what type of company so long that you have a company that fulfill the requirement of the questions that we have all right okay kind of uh -huh. any other question Don't know what to ask because you you haven't started it yet, right? Is it? Uh, we got two individual assignment. The first one is we need to like briefly introduce the warehouse we choose, and then second assignment only we we elaborate more. Is it? Okay. If you listen to the uh, if you look uh, thoroughly on the questions that I provided to you, all right. So number one, okay, okay, task number one for the individual, all right. So you have to explain on this uh, uh, warehouse activity profiling, all right. And then uh, on the uh, second individual assignment, all right. So you should explain on the uh, uh, all issues on the entrepreneurial uh, opportunity, all right. So. As I told you just now, all right, after this, Nitya will assist us in uh, getting uh, the name of the company that you choose, all right? So my advice to you, all right, uh, to make your life easy, all right, not that easy also, lah, all right, uh, to, to assist you in this matter, all right, uh, it is good if you choose only one warehouse, all right, but it answers to both a uh, question, individual assignment one, individual assignment two. All right, is that clear? Yes, doctor, but the, the first assignment, we choose the warehouse and then we need to write the process according to the yeah. warehouse company. Yeah. Yes, yes. Okay, okay, uh -huh. thank you, uh -huh. doctor. Thank you. The, the thing that is going to be a bit challenging is uh, when when uh, you sit down in your group member, uh, five uh, of you in one group, and then you have to decide what company, all right, what company and what are the topic that you want to choose, all right. So uh, after that, that topic should cover this one, lah. all right. Uh, I mean, uh, you, you should discuss uh, with your team member, all right, uh, so uh, the, the, the assignment given here is uh, the group assignment one and then, uh, all right, so you need to choose, okay, on, on uh, writing uh, the topic in, in the article form. This is another challenge. And then uh, the second challenge is when you, um, all right, when you choose the company, all right, we want you to evaluate the company, overview how the business go about, what are the activities involved, all right. Different, as I told you, different com warehouse company would have a different way of doing things. So these are the things that we want you to evaluate because uh, when you see, then only uh, you will really understand. Okay, people always say seeing is believing, all right. Yeah. For example, lah, you know this is bunga raya, all right. But the bunga raya, uh, you have five petals, all right. But uh, you never know how how what are the challenges that makes uh, uh, the the bunga raya become so unique. So it must have a certain characteristics what makes it unique. So the same thing like when you go to a warehouse, all right, you visit the warehouse physically, and then you know what are the challenges in the warehouse, all right. So what are the operation issues and how they do reverse logistics, right? Uh, how many people are involved in inbound activities? How many people involved in outbound, all right? And then what are the uh, skills uh, required among uh, people working in that warehouse, all right? What about the issue on safety, how they go about, all right? So these are the things that we want you to, to, uh, to learn, and you really understand how how warehouse activities look like, all right? Okay. Any other question? Okay. Uh, doctor. Yeah. Uh, for in the slide five number five, the task three, 
Is it our video presentation? Uh, okay, uh, can you can come up with a video presentation or you can simply, uh, uh, we want you to provide a slide note or if you don't have any, uh, if you have, uh, you wanted to put it into a video, okay, maybe you can come up with a video, all right, but we need you to come up with the, uh, uh, your own video on warehouse activity profiling, huh? Okay, uh, mm -hmm. and then there are two uh, individual assignments. So only the first individual assignment need to do a video only? Yeah, yeah. Okay, uh, another question is, uh, Doctor, can we use Google Spreadsheet for all the companies? Because it's easy for us to okay. see which topic. Sure, 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 sure. All right, okay. so Nitya, Google Spreadsheet, can you assist on this so that our friends can uh, provide to you better... Uh, so that everyone can see uh, what are the companies chosen and then so uh, we're not going to uh, because the, the idea for us to have a variety of company is because of you know different company have different way of doing things as i told you we learn about warehouse management system wms different company different warehouse different types of wms so and then from there on you can see what are the differences what are the similarities? So these are the unique things, all right? Any questions? All right, so uh, Nitya will assist me and then I uh, hope you uh, help you guys with the spreadsheet so that you can get the name of the, uh, of the companies uh, involved. So, uh, any other questions? All right. I believe that uh, you don't have much questions because now uh, try working on this one. All right. Uh, I hope that uh, I will give you uh, extra time for you to do starting from now. Uh, you may start uh, doing the uh, second uh, quiz or uh, you want to wait uh, until uh, midnight to, to settle down all your problems with the uh, warehouse video or whatever. And most important, uh, by today, uh, with the spreadsheet, uh, we will have the name list of the company and, and uh, the location of the warehouse. Lah. Um, doctor? Yes. For the quiz too, um, at the uh, online, they kata no question have been added. Tak ada platform nak submit answer kami dekat situ. Tak ada platform eh? Um, uh, so let let me check and I assist you on this one. Okay, doctor. Yeah? All right. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, I will give you some time to prepare uh, and discuss with your group members and uh, see how you want to uh, start thinking on how you want to uh, coordinate, integrate and implement your assignment. Yeah. Okay, thank you very much. Uh, that's all for now. Uh, we will uh, communicate further uh, if there is any uh, matter arising. All right. Okay, thank you very much. Kita tangguhkan kelas kita dengan Tasbiki Farah dan Surah Wahas. Don't forget your... your